secret cartridge club handshake. Okay, welcome to another uh, pickup video, STC uh, style. Bill and Joe, how's it going, Joe? Good, I'm here. This is a long one come, this is all Bill's stuff. It's been uh, like three weeks of crap piling up, so let's get at it. This, I think this was three weekends ago at yard sailing. Got nothing except for this, this stuff, uh, a Wii wireless sensor bar. That was cool. 360 rechargeable battery pack. All this stuff is sealed. And uh, component audio video for a Wii. You can always use an extra one of those. Action replay for a DSi. Do you know anything about these? What is that? I don't know. I, I, thousands of game busting codes. I don't know, it goes in the DS somehow. Hmm. An extra 3DS uh, screen protector, which you always need. And uh, look at this, 360 charge system with two batteries. Nice. So that's cool, man. Remember uh, I got that 360 a while back that was supposed to be broken and it uh, the two controllers had broken batteries? There you go. So next we'll start going through some other, I think this is mostly Value Village stuff. Check this out. Boom. Namco. Some, something yellow. Namco Pac-Man. What's this piece of junk? Yeah, it's a plug and play. All the cords are hidden in there. You open this up, take the cords out. Really nice controller, but you know what? It's got all the Namco favorites on there, including Pac-Man, Mrs. Pac-Man, Galaga, all that stuff is on here. Check this out. Pokemon, little DS carrier. And uh, they were slipping on this one. I think they had like two bucks on it. Value Village. This was uh, yard sale stuff, I think. Time Splitters 2. Uh, Manhunt. Ultimate Spider-Man, Legends, another compilation, with some Space Invaders, and check this out, yeah, Shenmue 2, both discs, this is, this is just the, on the case, so I can swap that case yeah, out. Well, I'll buy that off here for me. Mm -hmm. Put that back. Low price. So, no, I've been looking for that for a while. And I think each of these were like a buck each, if I recall. It was a really good yard sale find. A dollar. This was at a different thrift store in town, uh, one of those Bible places, you know? Mm. Five bucks. I uh, actually went to EB Games, five bucks for that. And I've been looking for this, Uncharted 3. That's at that Bible's for missions thrift store too. Drake's. Another Drake. All complete. This was, uh, I'll put that back. I think that was yards, yeah, yard sale. I got that for uh, two PS3 games, these two for five bucks. He wanted uh, five bucks each, but you, you, know, you wrote them off. Had to get a deal. Again, some more dollar games. The original times with it. What else we got here? Uh, where would I get this at? Must have been another yard sale. That's because I had the uh, original ones for the PS2, so I might as well grab that. Oh, wait a minute. No, we're getting into my auction stuff now. Remember that auction? Nope. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, so this is the auction stuff. I don't remember what the prices were, but they were all around five bucks each. Okay. So if you listen to the podcast, you heard what the actual prices were. I put this in, Motor Storm Pacific Rift. This is fun. This is a fun game. Definitely check that out if you uh, find it anywhere. I was smiling while playing it. Twisted Metal. There's one for you. I think I got that for you. That's uh, from the thrift store. Yeah, I already have that. Well, you don't have to buy it again because you told me, no matter what, that I'm supposed to just pick stuff up for you. Right? No, because you know yeah. I had that already. No, you told me. We'll no discuss what, that on the next podcast. No matter how, what, pick it up and you'll buy it off me. You so drop, you'll be buying that. That's a good one. PSP. Again, from that thrift store. I think this is from the auction still. Heroes of the Pacific. Dead Space is going to be a Cartridge Club game of the month, as you know, for what? October? Sure. 
Dragon Age, that's from the auction. That's remember I said I had the two, two games on one in there, right? The uh, Origins and Awakening. I've been needing this for a long time. Fallout Lost in New Vegas, the God of War Saga, or do you say Saga? I've already finished them. You have not. You but I'm a real game. I'm a real gamer. Obviously not by a Twitter poll. Dante's Inferno again from the auction, and these are the only cartridges from the auction. Star Wars Rogue Squadron, which I think in the sh podcast I accidentally said it was. Uh, well, what was it? I said dirty. I said it was something else. Yeah, clean it was Rogue around. Squadron. So that's a double. That's got to go somewhere. And uh, Robot Ron, right? Yep. Robot Ron. Did you play that? No. Robot Ron. Is it any good? Robotron. Knife Edge. Nose Gunner. And Urban Strike. All loose. Loosey goosey. I'll Make some room there. Make some room. As well from the auction, if you uh, heard from uh, the STC podcast, I picked up some broken consoles at the end. Check out this monster. Look at this guy. He's been through a few wars here. Someone's tried to uh, someone's tried to get this whole thing off or something. I don't know what, but uh, it's it's pretty roached. So this one doesn't work at all. It won't even turn on. I don't think. This is the other broken console. PS3 Fatty. Not the backwards compatible Johnny. Uh, this one, the, the light comes on, but it won't do anything else. None of the buttons work. Nothing else works. But people have spoken up for this already. They want it for the parts. So they're already going somewhere. This was the good one. Look at this. PS3 Slim. Supposedly doesn't work, but works fine. In fact, I played that motor storm on it for most of the night that one night. So that'll be going somewhere, right? To my house. The right price, no problem. Throw in Shenmue and I'll take it off your hands. Also found one of these in the garbage. Oh, a little right. bang box yep. for RF. Hit A or B, that's fun. It's good times right there. All right, what else? This other stuff was a Value Village pickup. I went with uh, Luke. You remember Luke, the projectionist? My buddy cousin Luke. We went to a value village out, well you would say out by the farm I guess. Chronicles of Riddick. And that has the Escape from Butcher's Bay on it. So end up six dollars. Uh, EA Replay. This is super fun. It's got all the Road Rash games on it for the PSP. I was playing this for a little while. Really fun. Five bucks. And another compo. Again, the, the Namco stuff. Pac-Man and Galaga and all that jazz. Another five bucks. And then Ratchet and Clank for the PSP. Four bucks. Hmm. And... Oh, gosh. Boom. Why am I in love with these so much? I'm loving the uh, the game guides nowadays. I'll give you five for that. You'll give me five for it. You'll give me five for it. They had eight dollars on it. I'll give you eight dollars for it. Eight dollars and eight. Battlefield Three isn't even worth eight dollars. I don't want. Yet they have I the just, game guide for eight dollars. Yoink! No, put that back. You don't need it. Again, this is all at Value Village. Spotted this thing. Ooh. Ooh. Hey now. Look at the slipping price they had on here. Normally, this would be what for Value Village? 50, mm. 55 in the glass case? Yeah, probably like 39, 49. This was out with the regular electronics, nothing special about it. Silver controller, looks mint. Mint. And uh, there's the console and hookups and the instruction book. And man, like everything looks just absolutely mint on that. Mm, I've never seen a silver one. Well, you could buy this off me and get it. Twenty bucks. 
Mm, well, it's a collector's item. No, it's not. This is a collector's item. So the kicker is with this Value Village stuff. Would you just break that open? Did you just break that open? Uh, Did you hit the button? Now it's for $25. All this Value Village stuff, I had a 30% off uh, card. Uh, that's the only way to do it. So this thing came down to 13 bucks. this PS2. Yoink. And I think that's it. That's well, everything. I know what I'm buying off you. Okay. Pro price. Well, we'll start making a tally up, I guess. Maybe these will be trunk deals at the Berry Game Exchange. I get first dibs on these three things. Shenmue, I'll take the PS2, and the uh, guide. Hundy all together? Boom, boom. Boom. No, just that game's probably worth that. Like, no, bro price. No. Anyway, pretty good haul, man. All right. That's it. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Check out uh, the other stuff, right? You got anything to say? stcpod.com.